Well, Milan were founded back in 1899, while Inter were born nine years after that. It is one of the great rivalries in European club football. Milan against Inter coming up from the San Siro. Derek Ray in the commentary position, joined by Stuart Robson. And Stuart, we always relish these duels. Absolutely. Here we are at the San Siro for the greatest of derbies. I love this game. Both clubs have such a wonderful history. Let's hope I'm not disappointed. And a look at the Inter team. Well, 3-5-2 is a great system if you can get control of the midfield because your wing-backs can then play higher up the pitch and the front two can combine as a pair. But they need to dominate that central area. Milan's lineup looks like this. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4 4 2, and it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. And the contest begins. Olivier Giroud. Can he play it in? Not a great pass. Alexis Sanchez. It's very pleasing on the eye, this attack, which goes through Perisic. Well, news coming through of a penalty in one of the other matches, and Alex Scott can fill us in. Yep, yeah, it was a penalty for Cagliari. The keeper dived the right way, but it's hit his leg and went in. It's now 1-0 with five minutes played. Cheers, Alex. Oh, fancy footwork. It's been aimed towards the front first. And it's still... Can they forge ahead? Pivotal moment defensively. Valentino Lazaro. Perisic with the ball. Martinez. Did well to win the ball back. Milan really looking to bounce back after a poor result last time out against Sassuolo. How do you think this one will go, Stuart? Well, it was a disappointing loss, particularly at home. If today they can be a little bit more expansive with their passing and defend with greater urgency, I think they'll match their opponents in this one. Not every team needs an effective and proficient leader of the line, and Olivier Giroud falls in that category. Stuart, what should we look forward to seeing from him today? Well, Derek, the graphic tells you everything about his current form. Second in the table in terms of league goals, and he looks so threatening at the moment. He'll look to add to those numbers once again today. Right, time to get an update from Alex, because I believe there's been a goal in the Salernitana game. Yeah, it's a goal for Sassuolo. You could see he knew what he wanted to... It might be the moment to get them ahead. And how about that for a save? Delivering it. Well, sadly, too straight to worry the goalkeeper that time. Barella. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Lazaro. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. 
And unfortunately, we did have to cut Alex off there to confirm Sassuolo have scored in that game and they now hold a 1-0 lead. Good bit of pressing. Struggling to get it away. Oh, a really good header. But the goalkeeper there to cover up. Corner given. Well, not on the target. Space was at a premium, though. Ivan Perisic. Barella has it. Alexis Sanchez. Martinez. Foul there. Free kick awarded. Alexis Sanchez. Can he play it in? Well, that's the kind of player you want from your defender. Well, pressing really high. Chance to attack using wit. Oh, this is looking promising. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Now, someone has scored in one of the other matches. Let's find out exactly who. Alex Scott will tell us. It's a goal for Bologna. They've scored the opener here with 32 minutes played. Many thanks, Alex. Alexis Sanchez. An effective challenge. Well, as you can see from the possession, there's been little between these two teams. It's been a really tough... Zero! Spectacular save, top-class goalkeeping. Brozovic. Alexis Sanchez. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. Zlatan Ibrahimovic promising looking ball can he put them in front oh off the post still alive well you sense the goal's coming they're getting so close now they just need to take one of these chances I believe there's been a goal in one of the other matches Alex Scott has the details it's a goal it's now 1-0 with 41 minutes on the clock. Thank you, Alex. And Perisic takes it forward. He has teammates he can play it to. But quick thinking defensively. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. One thing Olivier Giroud has is know-how, but is this a below-par performance from him so far? Well, he didn't contribute enough in that first half. I think he needs to work harder to get on the ball. He was far too static. In my view, he's got to make more runs behind this back line in the second half. And the contest begins. And how about that for a save? As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway.
Martinez. Still passing it around with authority. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. And acres of space out wide for Milan. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Attending to his defensive chores. Oh, what's he gone and done? Great. Ibrahimovic! And there it is! The opening goal! 1 0, and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, to get the ball rolling again. It's going to be interesting to see whether or not that goal stings them into action. Valentino Lazaro. Alexis Sanchez. Top class defending. For Inter, ball lost. And this is Brozovic. And the goal kick it'll be. Too much height on the shot. Substitution time it is. Well, the stats tell you everything. The chances have been few and far between. And they haven't tested the goalkeeper anywhere near enough. If they want to get something from this game, they're going to have to improve in the final third. Has a go. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Brozovic. Just hearing something important has happened in the Udinese game. Alex Scott can give us more information. It's a goal for Sampdoria. It's now 1-0 with 59 minutes gone. Alex with the info as ever. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Brahim Diaz now. An incisive pass. Couldn't grab hold of it. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Giroud. Oh, that is a superb save. Alexis Sanchez. Oh, magnificent reaction. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can they find the equaliser here? And deciding to go short with this one. So a corner kick it'll be following the deflection. Trying to pick out a teammate. Insufficient guile from that corner. Keeper's ball. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Davide Calabria. Well, Inter have it back now. Alexis Sanchez. Absolutely spot on, and they keep the ball. There's a slide rule pass. But the flag goes up offside. Well, he just needs to play that a bit sooner. The pass was definitely on. And a substitution in the offing. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Wonderful chance. Vigorous defending. Just can't get it past them. Martinez, body on the line. Manera Zuri regaining possession. A terrific pass. Superb stop. Alexis Salamakers. Nicely cut out. And a goal has gone in in the Udinese match. Alex Scott. It's another goal for Sampdoria. They're ahead by two now, with just over 10 minutes left to play. Cheers, Alex.
Just 10 minutes to go. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Has a go. And the... Keeper more than equal to it. Barella. Now someone has scored in one of the other matches. Let's find out exactly who. Alex Scott will tell us. It's a goal for Spezia. They're back level. It's one all with just under 10 minutes left to play. What a game we have here, Derek. Alex keeping us right up to date. Given away by the Rossoneri. Chalanolu. The ball with Martinez. Promising looking ball. And this is Brozovic. And the danger still on. Is this the moment? And able to close down the shot. Well, the corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage in the game. Played over. Well, it still could be dangerous. And I think the threat has been averted. Well, the counter chance looks very real. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Now well, he'll be irked with himself. Ran into an offside position. Chalanolu well on the attack hunting for a late equaliser here superb block so there it is the referee says that will do it for this contest and Milan the winners what did you make of it all? well Derek it was a really tight game but they were the better side over the 90 minutes and they fully deserved their victory today Well, a typically eye-catching performance from Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Interested to know what you made of him. Yeah, good performance and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today.